Are you tired of those screen recorders that make your computer lag like you're playing Minecraft with 8 shaders? Well, I have the solution for you. Oh, hello there! Yeah. Today I'm going to be showing you the best free no watermark screen recorder or game recorder for your potato computer or PC. Before I show you the screen recorder, please like the video if this helped and maybe consider subscribing if you haven't already. I'm trying to get one more subscriber by the end of this millennium. <clears throat> A millennium is a lot of years. So, the recorder is called... These nuts! The recorder is Loki. Like I said, it's free and has no watermark so you don't need to embarrass yourself in front of your viewers in your videos. So let's show you how to download it. Okay, so I'm here in my browser, which is Google, and um, you, what you want to type here is lowkey.gg, and it will bring you to this website. Now, this is the official website for Loki, and you can like download the app here. You can see a bunch of videos, but I'm just gonna click download app on the top right. Next, you can choose whether you want to download on an iOS, iOS app. You want to download the iOS app or the Windows app. I have Windows, so I'm going to click on the Windows app. Okay, now I'm just going to wait for this to download and then I'll show you the app. Okay, we're here at Loki and this is the dashboard. This is like the first thing you see when you open the app. It shows your recordings and your uploads so this is all the recordings I did and um, this is all the uploads I did these are the uploads that I made there are other tabs here like create challenges and browse but I don't use them browse is like for a bunch of videos you can see from other people I don't use them now here it says wait for game to start so that means um, it's looking for a game to start so you can record it but right now there's no game that I'm playing so it won't record and that's what it shows if you're just recording without a game now you can go to the settings tab up here and choose where you want to save your videos. I save my videos on my C drive. I, I do want to save it on my D drive, but I don't. So I just leave it on my C drive. If you want if you want to like change it, you can just click on this and you can change it. I leave my local storage at unlimited. I don't know what that does. So capture. Now capture, there are two captures, game capture and display capture. I leave it on game capture because I want to record only my games and not my videos. Right now I'm using the Windows 10 recorder for for uh, recording, but I use the game capture for recording my games. Here automatically record games. I leave this on because if something really cool happens and I miss it and I didn't record, it already, already records for me, so I leave this on. Automatically upload clips under two minutes. Now what this what this means? I don't. It doesn't mean that it'll upload clips to your YouTube. It just means it'll download it within the app. When I reach my storage limit, I delete. So this, I leave it on, off because I don't want anything to be deleted unless I want to delete it. So I keep it there, off, I keep it off. Next, video and audio. Here you have frame rate and the bit rate of your videos. I leave my frame rate on uh, 30 FPS. It depends if you have a bad computer or a good computer. You can make it go all the way up to 60 FPS but I leave it on 30 FPS. And bitrate, just leave it at 15 Mbps. Now, uh, resolution width and resolution height. So you wanna choose this according to your monitor display. If your monitor display is 1920 by 1080, you make sure you put it on that. And mine is set to 1920 by 1080. So I leave it on that. Next, um, include webcam videos. I haven't, I don't, I don't record with my webcam, so I ignore that. Record computer and or game audio. Keep this one on if you want game audio. Record mic audio. I keep this on, and you can choose whether you want to, you can choose which input device and output device you want for your audio. So mine is this mic, uh, USB PNP audio device, and I keep this default. So this is where you hear the audio. Next, hotkeys. I just ignore this, but you can see it if you want. And fancy features, which is something else that I don't know. I don't mess around with this. 
yeah so this is basically what you need to know if you want to record again this is uploads it doesn't upload to your youtube it just uploads to your uh, it just downloads and then here are the other tabs again and yeah that's basically it okay so now you know how to download it and you know how to use it now you might be asking ivan what's the difference between your recorder and this recorder well little idiot this recorder is way better and i'm just gonna show you a few comparisons right now